Well, a rider who increased it yesterday in our semifinals was our top finisher, Dennis Anderson, coming all the way from Southern California. All the fans here are going absolutely crazy as Dennis Anderson rolls in, doing it for Vans, and Haro, big wall ride transfer. Wow, huge transfers that this guy does in his runs. Absolutely amazing combinations. One foot can-can seat grab. Seat grab, or that's basically a one-handed cannonball bar spin right there. Anderson speed jump into the turn, charging back. Where is he going, Ryan? Huge transfer again with a big tail whip into that Hurricane Parks quarter pipe. Great transfer up. That was a 360 step up transfer into the spine with the backflip tail whips clean to pedals as Anderson jumps into the capsule. Coming out of her honor core, going right up to the spine. Very unique lines for Anderson with the one handed X up. Here we go. Anderson going backwards, transfer on the box jump, getting another line in here. Huge cannonball. This is reminiscent of his second run, and there he goes, clearing that channel gap. 180 here on the spine as well, utilizing that free coaster. Amazing run down to the wire as well for the California local. So Anderson getting a full pull in his first run, having that 180 this time over the extended spine, a little different than the one that Ernest Zebolds did. Anderson choosing to do it at the end of his run. It's gonna be really interesting to see where his score sits with Ernest Zebolds. Now I know they both did a 180, their runs were very different. Dennis Anderson utilized the course like no other rider. He actually had big transfers, big wall rides, big tail whip gaps, and then showed that tech ability with the consistency on that 180. Anderson putting down an enormous run. That's why he was our top qualifier. You see him getting a pound out there from our on the ground MC Catfish. But let's take a look. That transfer was so wow. big. Nobody out there the entire weekend has even looked at doing that transfer let alone Dennis Anderson coming out there oozing with the style and as well then doing the next one over going from the UCI quarter pipe step up there and yes we have a new leader Dennis Anderson gets a 90 the first person to push into a 90s Anderson bumping into the 90s two and a half points higher than Declan Brooks out there Anderson Right there, throwing it up, super psyched, big run, but it's gonna come down to a little bit of strategy.